An Arkansas group is taking another step in fighting the state's opioid crisis. Back in November, we told you about the Arkansas Opioid Recovery Partnerships plans to disperse money from a $260 million settlement to organizations helping with that effort. They were awarded that funding today. THV 11's Frederick Price shows us how some plan to use it. The opioid epidemic impacts us all in some way. Over the last two years, Arkansas has lost over 1,100 people. For J.D. Skelton, director of Natural State Recovery Centers, a drug rehab, he dealt with substance abuse firsthand. I've been a, a drug addict for 35 years, and I spent 13 years of that in prison. After getting out, he wanted to give back and lead an effort to help those struggling with addiction. But running a detox and recovery center comes with challenges. You got to be able to serve more people. You got to have more beds. Friday, the Arkansas Opioid Recovery Partnership presented 13 groups with $25,000 to further their fight against this state's opioid crisis. It pays for that educational experience um, and the travel and everything to to be a part of that educational deal. These groups will go to personalized trainings to learn how to reduce opioid abuse in Arkansas and how to apply for the federal drug free support program. Natural State Recovery Centers is a part of four groups getting additional money to grow their organization. The settlement money has afforded Natural State to get a building uh, in downtown Little Rock. Rusty Hallwick is the CEO of the Guidance Center, which serves Western Arkansas. She says the money will add more recovery centers and support specialists, among other things. But our biggest one is to open a residential treatment center for substance abuse treatment. And it's just so needed. We have such a shortage of beds. She, like many other leaders here, tell me the funding could help them enhance resources they simply don't have to fight the opioid epidemic. We can now support them and funding small rural cities and counties to help them uh, get help where help has never been available before. Frederick Price, THV 11 News.